Week four of the high school football season officially in the books with eight Saturday games for us across the state of Vermont, including a D1 showdown down in Manchester. Essex trying to make it two victories in a row, taking on a hungry BBA team searching for its second victory of the season. Essex up 17-14 in the third. It's the Bulldogs on the march. Miles Tresky dropping back and lofting downfield. Thomas Sheldon falling somehow comes down with this defense flag for defensive pass interference. So the catch is good. Few plays later, Tresky dropping back again over the middle for Blaine Naquette. He will cross the goal line. Bulldogs ahead 2017 into the fourth. They're still up. Tresky going deep for Sheldon one more time going horizontal for this grab. However, the Hornets hold strong and would get the ball back. Essex able to run down the clock to 30 seconds. And from the two, Carter Crete just gets into the end zone to regain the lead. And Essex would hang on to win this one with a final of 24 to 20. Up now in Bristol, Mount Abe for Jens looking to stay above 500 as they hosted Otter Valley. The Eagles trailing early second. Tyler White rolling out near the Otter end zone to buy some time. He would find Ryan Wright wide open to give the Eagles a 12 to 7 advantage. Down now on the far side, the Otters on the move. Play action for Zach Dragon. He will float one up for Chase Razanowski to the high point. He would high point the ball and put OV right back in front. And it got worse before it got better for Mount Abe Virgins. White picked off by Noel Pearsons, and there is no one in front of him on the pick six. However, the Eagles would score 24 of the next 31. White from a yard out coming up here. And Mount Abe Virgins wins this one with a final of 36-27. Over now to Swanton as Missiscoy playing host to Rice. The Green Knights on the move with an early lead. Little reverse action here. Isaiah Lagas with it after a brief moment of cameraman confusion. He marches his way into opponent territory and down near the red zone. After the quarter flips, Griffin sights, finds Pater 22 to nothing. Rice in the second. Later on in the second, more Green Knight offense on the move. It sights around the outside. He would find the end zone once more, and Rice would stay unbeaten as they win it 56-6. to Some more high school scores for you from Saturday. Bellows Falls downing MMU 40-21. to The Bullets of BFA Fairfax Lamoille defeat Pulteney 27-7, and Milton down Spalding 18-13. to Two more, a couple of nightcaps for you. The Seawolves downing U32 28-21, and Springfield wins a defensive battle over Mill River 14-6.